God is going to hold you accountable for your life, not someone else's life. You're not going to be held responsible for anybody else. You're only going to be held responsible for what you do with your life. Your life is your own. You have to stand eventually before God, and you have to give an account to God for how you handled the gift that He gave you. How did you steward the life God gave you? How did you manage the life God gave you? What kind of ownership did you show over the life that God gave you. Now, this is vital because how you treat something you own is very, it tells a lot about you. There's a lot of folks that would identify perhaps with this. When you go and rent a car, uh, a car that's rented, you generally don't take it in for an oil change. You don't run it by the car wash before you take it back. You don't change the tires. You don't do anything to the car. You rent the car. You use it. You dump it back at the car dealership, wherever you rented it from, or car a rental uh, office, and you just used it without any sense of management over it. But the car you own is very different. There's a different set of responsibilities for what is yours compared to what doesn't really belong to you. And one day, all of us are going to stand before God and give an account of what we did with our lives. Listen to these verses. Romans 14, verse 12. Therefore, each one, notice that statement, each one must answer for himself and give a, give a personal account of his own life before God.